Hey, Robert Spitzer here, coming to you from Pigeon Cove on beautiful Lake Michigan. I love my life. I really, really do just love my life. But it wasn't always that way. It was, for the last 13 years, quite a struggle and I got beaten down by life a lot and it really took a lot of my spirit out of me. But I have, in the last year or so, been battling back and I'm here to tell you that it's all, always, always worth the fight. You deserve to have your spirit shine. You are here to give your gifts to the world. And if you are beaten down by life, you can struggle out of it and you can become the best version of yourself because that's why we have our struggles in life. We have our struggles so that we can fight to overcome them and be more of who we're meant to be in our lives. I just wanted to let that sink in for a minute there. Plus I've been was a little bit distracted by what's going on behind me, so I don't want to turn around and look, but that's what I have to say to you today, if you're in a position where you're feeling really beaten down, backed into a corner, or just like you are having a hard time going on in life, believe in yourself. Believe that you can do it because there's going to be someone who had a bigger challenge than you in life. There's going to be someone who had more to overcome than you have to overcome at this point in your life. Find people who will rally around you. Find people who will believe in you until you can really believe in yourself again. That's really important. Think about a time when maybe you didn't really believe in yourself. Maybe you uh, weren't so good in math or you believe you weren't so good in math until a math teacher showed you how good you really were or someone believed in you in your life. Think about that time and know that if you are in a place where you don't have someone to believe in you, you just need to find someone and don't be afraid to ask them for help. It's okay, we all need help sometime. When you're vulnerable and ask someone else from, for help, then they know that they can be free to come to you and ask you for help when they're in the same situation and you will feel so good about yourself when you can help someone else in the same situation. So don't be afraid to ask for help. I'm Robert Stritzinger. Remember that well-being comes from well-doing. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I'll see you on the next video.